New recommendations offer practical guidance for pain management in inflammatory arthritis patients, according to Dr. Samuel Whittle. At the annual European Congress of Rheumatology in London, Dr. Whittle presented recommendations from the Evidence Expertise Exchange, or 3E, initiative. These 11 recommendations focused on pharmacotherapy pain management for inflammatory arthritis. What were some of the reasons behind developing the 3E initiative? Well, the 3E initiative has been going now for four years as a multinational um, project. It's really a, a collection of uh, rheumatologists and epidemiologists who are aiming to, to pick areas of, of interest to the practicing rheumatologist to develop um, practical recommendations based on the questions that rheumatologists face every day in the clinic um, and then apply the best available um, systematically reviewed ev evidence and then combine that with the expertise of, of a group of rheumatologists from around the world. So pre Previous, uh, previous rounds have included the use of methotrexate in rheumatic diseases, management of ankylosing spondylitis and also the investigation of undifferentiated uh, peripheral inflammatory arthritis. And the 2010 3E initiative was looking at pain management in inflammatory arthritis by pharmacotherapy. What were some of the key issues that emerged for the 2010 recommendations? Well, it was interesting. It, um, it, there was a, a very large collection of questions which were uh, eventually pruned down to the 10 most important questions um, uh, via a, a formalised voting um, process. And each one of those questions then led to a systematic review. So most of, most of the questions revolved around different uh, pharmacological agents that are used as analgesics, but we also um, had a, have a recommendation regarding um, pain measurement in the clinic and also in the use of analgesics during the uh, pregnancy and lactation periods. What are the next steps? Well the next step is to disseminate the recommendations. We've, uh, from the 10 questions that were felt to be most important to clinicians, we now have 11 recommendations uh, and, and an algorithm for the management of pain in inflammatory arthritis. So those will, uh, will be published hopefully in the very near future. For Global Medical News Network, I'm Heidi Spleet.